welcome back to my channel in this tutorial we are going to learn how to install dot net framework on ubuntu 24.04 lts by following its official documentation so let's get started at first open your favorite web browser and then browse this url dot net dot microsoft dot com and then click on the download link and then follow the installation instruction for Linux this is the latest LTS version of .NET framework now scroll down and select the package where you want to install dotnet framework i'm going to install it on ubuntu select this select the ubuntu version okay now I am going to install dotnet sdk 8 copy this command and open a new terminal and update your system using this command with sudo privilege sudo apt update enter the password for this user hit enter it may take a while for updating the system after updating the system paste this command here hit enter it may take a while for installing dotnet SDK on your system as an alternative to the ASP.NET Core runtime you can install .NET runtime which does not include ASP.NET Core support so replace this command in the previous command with dotnet runtime okay now copy this and paste here hit enter dotnet runtime is already the newest version installed on my machine okay dependencies can be installed with the apt install command the following snipes demonstrates installing the library using this command already installed the newest version okay now verify that dot net is already installed or not on your system using this command that's it and also check runtime version using this command that's it now I am going to create a console application with .NET SDK using Visual Studio Code 
by following its official documentation. At first, start Visual Studio Code, the folder where you want to store the newly created folder. Now, select the folder where you want to create a new folder. I'm going to create a new folder in my desktop. Click on this icon to create a new folder. And here, name the folder. My case, hello world. Now open this folder in Visual Studio Code. Trust the authors. Okay. Now open the terminal in Visual Studio Code by selecting View Terminal from the main menu. Okay. And then run this command. Now install an extension that is recommended for c -sharp programming language. Install this extension c -sharp dev kit. It may take a while for installing this extension. I am going to run this application using this command after installing this extension you can easily run this program run project associated with this file That's it. If you are uh, new to this channel, subscribe this channel and like, comment, share. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial.